Today is an important issue I want to address and that is the issue of eating out with friends and feeling like the weird one when you're the one eating raw vegan and everyone else is eating the cooked stuff. So how do you stand your ground? How do you not give in to those pure temptations? Well, certain people cave under social pressures and certain people don't. I was definitely one to not cave under social pressures. In fact, I've always been the one to stand out and not give a sh what anyone thinks. Uh, or if I do care what they think, it's because I want them to, to think differently. So actually, I care about them thinking, but I don't care about them thinking negatively about me. So I definitely care what other people think in that I want them to think good thoughts. I want them to think about the fresh, raw, living fruits and veggies and coconuts and the living foods. Fresh, raw, living foods. I want people to think about that. So I do care what people think in that sense. But I don't care if they judge me negatively for doing what I know is right. So if you know that eating fresh, raw, living foods is the right way to go, then do that. Don't live a lie. Don't live a lie like the masses. The masses, they a lot of them know that fresh, raw, living foods is the way to go. They may not know that you can live entirely on it. But a lot of people who do watch my YouTube videos, they, they know that they can live on fresh, raw, living foods. They just have a hard time with it. Um, due to the, the cravings. You've got to just uh, be honest with yourself and realize that fresh raw living foods always makes you feel good and the cooked foods always make you feel like ugh. So just break the habit. Be aware of it and just break the habit. And it's easier said than done. Okay, how to break the habit. Hold a vision of yourself as the raw vegan. Hold your vision of yourself as the person who eats just raw food. Be that guy. Be that girl. Be that raw fooder who just is that raw fooder. The person who only eats raw living enzyme activated fruits be that person man it's all right we we live once we're, we live once on this earth we're always going to exist but we live once on this earth you might as well always eat the good stuff man if you want to go ahead and eat the cooked food then go ahead and eat the cooked food uh piece, speaking from personal experience i won't and i can't do that anymore i can't and i won't but if you want to go right ahead i'm not saying that you have to eat raw living fresh fruits if you don't want to do what you want. Eat them if you want. Don't eat them if you don't want. Um, some practical tips before going out and eating with your friends. Load up. Carb up. Eat like a crap ton of bananas or a crap ton of dates or drink like a whole bunch of orange juice or bring stuff with you. Or when you go to restaurants, I definitely order I definitely order uh, cucumbers and tomatoes. I'll just say, do you got eight cucumbers and four tomatoes back there? Or eight tomatoes, four cucumbers, I'll take that. Um, something else I do is I'll, I'll pick the restaurant. I'm eating a guy tomorrow at 12 o'clock for lunchtime. Gotta remember to do that. Um, so I'm go I said, hey, do you want to go to this raw cafe or that raw cafe? I gave him two options. He's like, oh, we'll go to that one. I don't know if he knows it's raw or not, but we're going to a raw cafe tomorrow. So I pick the outings. You pick the outings if you want. Um, but another thing, just, yeah, be a leader, man. Be a leader. This world lacks leaders. This world lacks leaders. Leaders are in high demand. The world is just waiting for someone to take charge and just drive home the important message of being healthy, man. Make being healthy cool again. Make being healthy cool again. That's all I got to say on this topic, man. Now, if you want to cave into social pressures, maybe maybe find a different group of people, create a different group of people, and cave in to their social pressures. The type of people that I want to cave into are the people who are holding me to a higher standard. I would love to cave into social pressures if the pressures I'm caving into are <laughs> taking me somewhere higher. So I guess rather than caving in, I'm more like, ascending ascending to these uh social upswings